eight minute zero game. See how we get on. Let's attack the pawn. When a pawn meets the pawn, take or do we take the poison pawn? Options and choices. Aggressive opening. We take is going to push down onto the pawn. Let's go simple. Let's not overcomplicate it. Let their aggression just seep out. So yes, they're a very aggressive player. Attacking, attacking, attacking. Just need to make sure we sort our bid out before we think about jumping in anywhere. So next thing is they're going to be an attack and attack and attack. I'm hoping they don't know how to defend. So we're going to take. So constant attacks. Every move they make is just going to be some sort of attack. No defense work. Take, attack, 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 now you're attacking the pawn, every move is going to be on point attack, oh they've not done that, let's take, they've gone for defense, Ooh, okay, I'm shocked at that, I must say I have shocked at that. Is it a matter of taking time to go and castle? Let's go and castle. So one defense, which I'm very surprised at. And they're going defending again now. So it's like they feel like they've burnt out themselves. I'm going to bring the knight out. Defense, defense, defense. Now they're just focused on defending. Yeah, let's attack the um, bishop. It's got no protection. Still need to try and get my pieces working as some sort of team. Bishops now kind of jammed in a little bit. Is it okay there for now? Maybe not. How do we fashion it working with the pieces? Would be nice to get here to get here, but the knight is there currently. Knight's jammed in, so do we redirect, give the king some company? But obviously, just going to bring the bishop off the back is targeting a pawn here rook is jammed in but we just can't get to it get the knight here but they'll be playing defense nanny won't they stopping the pawn knight from jumping in we'll go for it anyway could have actually spent that time doubling the rooks now i think about it now that i think about it let's get the knight up it's defended by the bishop looking to try and cause some havoc in here but they've got protection all over the place so a small pawn move just going to send the knight back attacking this pawn that's got no protection let's attack the pawn that's got no protection like we said bishop comes to defend or oh, the knight swings itself around to defend So nothing clear at the moment. What's clear is potentially trying to get these rooks here owning the file. Simple.
The knight has come to defend. Didn't actually see that. <laughs> okay, right. So this pawn's got no protection, but we can't get to it because our bishop is jammed in. So we could attack their bishop, their knight, but their knight is guarding this area. Uh, so there's not a right lot to be done. Could bring the bishop here and attack the pawn. Or let's focus on getting the doubling as best possible. That was the original plan. So looking to hit the knight, I suppose. I'm going to just bring the rook through. Okay, it's on a dark square. Bishop, 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 bishop. Can't go here just yet. Could just start moving the knight. Just move the knight round the back in readiness for attacking. There's nothing else happening at the minute. This knight is holding on for dear life onto this. Could simply just push the pawn up. What is this? It's opening up his king side. He wants to hit on our bishop. We want to move the bishop anyway, but we will we'll no longer be able to do that because he's got the two pawns on there. The two rhino heads. He's really focused on defending this. What can we do? Anything? No weaknesses at the minute apart from this one here, but we can't do anything about it. Could do a simple move here, but I think you'll just push down. Could bring the pawn here just to meet this pawn. Could then go and attack their knight. Knight takes, pawn takes. like he's fashioning some sort of attack towards our king side move the king maybe not onto the dark square yeah, it's going to make a difference he's got a dark squared bishop <clears throat> so you think maybe we go onto the white square oh time's running out yeah okay Started slipping into long, long, long play thinking. And shall we do this? Really does jam our white square bishop in, doesn't it? We do that, it takes, we take. what it's here to do that's what the bishop's saying i'm here to get jammed in give my king some company protect the pawn opponent's going to be trying to open up space around the king it's 
time is running down though. Okay, so they've moved the night. That must mean something for us. Something positive. Let's move the bishop back. It's coming around to do something. Attacking pawns. Attacking bishops. Supporting the pawn with the bishop. Dangerous, very dangerous. Let's just go here. Probably getting the night around this way, holding the night to ransom because it's supporting the bishop for now. Getting a bit clever. Bring the rook up. Is it any good? Time's running out, dude. What do we got? What do we got? Bishop, bishop, bishop. Fast, 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 isn't it? It's going to get a passer. Hmm. This one's very strange. bit good this player is aren't they with the little night maneuvers interesting times under pressure of the clock as well hmm yeah that's too many night moves dude not wearing it.
Well, quite pleased at that. Magical night moves under pressure of time. But we maintain some sort of positional play on the board. I'm going to have a look at the analysis though, just to check what is transpiring here. Let's just switch that on. And it's like, crikey. It's neither here nor there. It's minus 0 0.2 for the opponent. Wow. But because they ran out of time, obviously. Yeah, very tight. Couldn't get my bishop out. I was trying to plan to try and get it out here. Yeah. There, but for the grace of the clock, goes I. No problems. Don't think it was too damaging. Let's. I'm going to quickly flick through. And see. Because they come through very aggressive. If there's massive dips, then we will pay attention. But it didn't feel like there was anything major in the game. Just the magical night moves coming towards the end. So it's fairly drawish. Yeah, it's nothing to write home about. So it don't look like we did anything, anything majorly wrong at the minute. Little dip there. Okay, so they've got like a minus one there. That's with our bishop. So they had a bit of heftiness there with the knight move. But it didn't get followed up. Yeah, there was something with the knight move. Uh, maybe they were maybe they were supposed to use other pieces as part of the team to help build the advantage it was creating. Yep, yeah, nice one. 